Game 3 of the NBA Finals. The Golden State Warriors have showed up hungry and determined to fight for what they believe is rightfully theirs. Will they be able to break the stalemate and come out on top against the Boston Celtics? This is the NBA Playoffs. It's up next. And it's the start here of Game 3 of the NBA Finals. 2K Sports postseason presentation of the NBA, and it's tied 1-1. Tonight, it'll be the Boston Celtics going up against the Golden State Warriors. With Brent Berry and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan, and David Aldridge will be joining us on the sideline as well. Hey, Dave. Thank you, Kevin. Marcus Smart stands six foot three, but he said, I can guard bigs, so I started making a joke. I'm a stretch six. Forget a stretch five. My teammates loved it, and it just stuck with me. He added, I'm the youngest of four boys, so I've been up against bigger guys. For me, that means nothing. Kevin? <laughs> stretch six. I love that. Great stuff, David. Thank you. And take a look at the Warriors. Well, they had one taken from them on their home court. Big time wake up call there, Greg. We saw it. They've responded. And this is their opportunity for revenge. And Kevin, throughout the season, they've been the better team. But that all goes out the window now. This is a very even fight. They need to find a way to reassert their dominance, or this thing could actually slip away from them. It sure could. Here we go. Now, Golden State's starting five. And the old core of this team out there, Curry and Clay, is guards with Draymond at four. Higgins is out there with Weissman. And for the Celtics, Smart in the backcourt with Brown to his side. Williams is out there with Horford, and it's Tatum in its small forward. Brown, good. Assertive shot for Brown. Once he has the ball, he quickly makes a selection and commits. Weissman the pass to Wiggins. Thompson outside. Down to five on the shot clock. On ten feet out. And it's off the back rim. No good. Yeah, my expectations were that he was not going to miss that one. He handles that kind of defense, especially on the inside. Williams against Green. Williams kicks to Brown. Now here's Tatum. He's guarded closely. Horford has a wide open look. Off target from outside. Well, even though he misses that one, the defense has got to talk about that. And that's a bad miscue. And you can't give up looks like that all game long. Just setting the tone with an aggressive move to the rack. And, and where's the help defensively? Yeah, APB sent out to try to find out where the defense is. Inexcusable. Here's Horford. Following the basket by Andrew Wiggins. Horford with the screen on Wiggins. The 17-footer. A nice shot by Tatum. And even back in high school, Tatum had the knockdown mid-range jumper. We don't see that as much from him now, but he's still got that in his bag. Now here's Green. To the middle. Here's Thompson. And Thompson throws it down. And how about that? What a sensational finish. you, you got to be able to get some hang time to do that one. Austin's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Brown outside. Williams sets a screen for Brown. And there's the drive. And the shot goes down. Brown's got five now. And really, Brown is astonishing when he takes it inside. The defense does not know what to do with it. Her. Again, Golden State. And the D just a step slow, reacting to the step back. And so it's smart. He'll bring up the ball for the Celtics. This is it to Tatum. There's the triple. Warriors with the rebound. They'd like to continue the success they had on Friday night here. And in that one, the backups came to play. Gave the team an infusion of points that just put them over the top. Well, I talked to the assistant coaching staff. What they were stoked about is that the bench guys came in and played well. So punch off the bench, a big factor in that one. Shot clock at three. Curry can't get it to go. The Celtics with the lead. 
down inside by Green. Great D that time from Green. Thompson outside, and it's Jason Tatum with the foul. That's his first foul. Kevon Looney is checked in for Golden State. First team foul. Substitution for the Warriors. Kevon Looney. And we're approaching about three and a half minutes played in the first quarter. Wiggins with it. Williams picks him up. Shot from 12. Second chance shot. Looney with the bucket. Kind of a simple Looney. job for Looney out there, but he's willing to do it. Gets into the middle and fights for that ball. Smart passes to Tatum. Pass to Horford. Outside, Smart. Lock at six. Austin needs to get off a shot. And here's Brown outside. Good, and Smart gets the assist. Brown's got his third basket of the night right there. The Warriors trailing. Curry passes to Looney. Brown against Wiggins. Shoots over Brown, and it's Wiggins missing. That's one he knows he should have drained. Smart passes to Brown. From outside, off the mark. Warriors have gone 50% from the field to this point. Four of eight. Green dishes to Curry. Looney gets to Green. Bobbed up there for Thompson. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley-oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Smart on the wing. Into the lane. Can't hit that one. And it's the Warriors taking it the other way. Green passes to Wiggins. Curry against Brown. Some nice passing by Golden State. Out to Thompson. Just five to shoot. It's Curry with the drive. And it's Green missing. They'll have a hard time shaking that one off. Perfect position. Plenty of space. Just clanked it. Smart up top. Guarded by Kirk. Smart passes to Horford. Over Wiggins. Horford no luck. Well, the defense was right up on him, so electing to go for the fadeaway there to create some room. Well, that makes sense. And Green gets it to go. Well, this is opening up scoring opportunities because Curry's such a great shooter. Guys are going to be open. Austin's gone 2 of 5 from three point land here in the first quarter. Curry against Smart. Brown outside. And it's off from three point range. The Warriors have gotten 5 of 10 shots to drop in this game so far. Right at the 50% mark. Thompson passes to Looney. On the way, Wiggins. Guarded by Tatum. And it's sent back by Horford. Well, the level of engagement that Horford brings on the defensive end every night is impressive. Terrific block there. The Warriors pull it in. Looney's got four rebounds now tonight. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin, particularly here to start the game. Curry passes to Thompson. Outside, Green. Back to Thompson for the three. And he gets it back. Outside, Curry. The second chance effort. No good that time. Now Boston takes it the other way. Outside Williams. He's looking for Horford and finds him. And that one drops for him. And the Celtics lead by two. My coaches like it when big guys can consistently step out there and knock down jump shots. Al Horford spaces the court like few others his side. Let's see who gets the longest and who wants a t-shirt. All right, looking 
coming on up to the court. Come on and get wild. Here are the Celtic Sensors. And a new group in for the Celtics. Daniel Tice is checked in for Robert Williams. Williams comes in for Al Horford. Derek White's checked in for Tatum. And it's Pritchard in for Marcus Smart. Different look here for the Warriors. Kuminga's come in for Green. Porter comes in for Andrew Wiggins. Gary Payton has checked in for Thompson. And Poole subbed in for Stephen Curry. Here's Kaminga. Peyton outside. Pass to Poole. Tries to keep it alive. Six on the shot clock. And the layup's good off the glass. Poole's got the game tied up here for the Warriors. Yeah, and there it is again. On a lot of their possessions this first half, they've established great inside position. Here's Brown. And finished off by Brown. And just awesome speed from Brown. Blasting off towards the bucket and slamming it down. The Warriors have gone 6 of 14 shooting the ball since the start of the game. Cool with it. He kicks it to Kaminga. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Boston's gotten just two of six to fall from three-point range so far in the first. And it's White missing. Golden State's gone 0-3 from three-point land. Nothing yet going outside. Porter passes to Poole. Unloads from nine. Rebounded by the Celtics. White looking around. He takes it in. Banked in off the glass. And the Celtics lead by four. On offense, here are the Warriors. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Looney kicks to Payton. And here's Poole for three. It's good for a second make. He's made two or three so far. And he likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. Brown outside. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. And the vertical that Brown has is pretty impressive as relentless a finisher as you'll find in our line. It's his first trip to the line. At the line for two shots. Shooting two. And the first one at the line is good. And the Warriors making a change here. Ayelitz has checked in. Them both. Here's Poole. He has five. Now the pass to Payton. And Bialitz kicks to Poole. Porter against Brown. 17 foot shot on the way. That one wide left. Austin leading by three. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. 156 left in the first quarter. Again, the miss by the Celtics. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. And there's the bucket from Kaminga. Such a critical part of how their offense is going to flow. Things are only working when he seems to be on the floor. Here's Pritchard, guarded by Poole. Brown inside. Porter's there. And it's Brown missing. And it's Porter with the ball for Golden State. They trail by one. 
Now, here's Poole. Tight defense on him. Out of bounds as the Celtics gain possession. Now, I'm all for the crowd interacting with the players, but not so much the players interacting with the crowd. That one errant pass. Defense doesn't get much better than the mobile one block we just saw on replay. And this is postseason play at its finest, refusing to give up shots here in the playoffs. Brown outside. Hands it from downtown. Brown's got 15. As hot as he's been this quarter, the game plan is simple, folks. Get him the ball and get out of the way. Now, here's Kaminga. It's rebounded by Tice. Austin leading by four. Round the pass to Pritchard. 34 seconds left in the first. And no good. And it's the Warriors taking it the other way. Inside, there's Kaminga. And Kaminga throws it down. And not the prototype power forward, but he has tremendous athletic ability. The Celtics shooting 40% here in the early stages. Down against Porter. And he gets the bucket. 17 points in the game. A gorgeous looking jumper from Brown there. The more attempts he gets in the the better his jump shot. Jalen Brown has been leading the charge for the Celtics. Going on an absolute rampage, piling in the points. He dictated the pace of the entire quarter. Back right after this. Fans, your Celtics dancers. Well, he's won at the highest levels, and Steph Curry understands what's required to get back to that lofty position. Stay in the moment and just focus on here and now. Um, we have to follow that kind of you know, game plan. Um, stay in the moment, do what we do every single night, and go get it. Are you here to watch? Keeping your focus. And as much defensive attention as Curry commands on a nightly basis, he can't afford a lapse of focus. And we're back with you as these two teams do battle in their quest for an NBA championship. When you consider how the Celtics are doing, guys, what jumps out to you? Stats one. Coming in hot. They were sharp from the perimeter right out of the gate. They just couldn't seem to know what it was that they needed to do and how to stick them from outside. The defense pretty lost. Setting the floor for the Warriors. Marcus. And the old Marcus. core of this team out there, Curry and Clay, is guards with three miles and four. The Elita is out there with Andrew Wiggins. Williams, he's checked in for the Celtics. Green with a screen on Smart. That's it, and the Celtic lead is cut down now to just two points with that basket from Stephen Curry. Yeah, that was the third straight high percentage look the defense has allowed. The, the defenders have got to start putting bodies on bodies. Now here's Smart. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Tatum passes to Williams. He's such a physical player. Williams has no off switch which is how he gets these calls. The Celtics have been perfect at the line so far, albeit just two for two. At the line for your Celtics, Robert Williams. At the line for two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And that one falls for Williams. And on top of the talent, the, the physical ability, w Williams, just a coachable kid and really picks things up quickly. So he picks up just one from the line that time. Something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. To the inside. That's good from Horford on the assist by Tatum. Horford's got the lead up to five now for the Celtics. 
Unselfish play by Tatum, getting it to a shooter in rhythm instead of chasing his own shot. Curry against Smart. Down low. And there's the whistle. Three-second violation. Looney's checked in for Bielitsa. Warriors substitution. Javon Looney. Celtics leading by five. Outside, White. And here's Tatum for three. Kept alive by Boston. Count that one. Yeah, hard trying to keep Williams off the boards. He makes it a mission to keep possessions alive. It's Curry with the drive. Rebound, Boston. That's the only kind of defense that's going to cut the mustard here tonight. you got to stay on top of a guy like that who can play at such a high level offensively. Now here's White. Seven-point game, the biggest lead in the game. Here's Horford. It's rebounded by Curry. Even if you're not shooting it, you like to see the effort level. And his tonight has been high. Shoots. Connects. The jumper drops. Seven. Curry's got his third bucket of the night. That's more like it. Rounding into form after a very, very difficult first quarter. Outside Williams. Dishes it to Tatum. It's good. Tatum's got his second bucket of the game to go. An incredible leaper at 6'8". Tatum is difficult to stop down low. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Smart against Kerr to the paint. Here's Thompson. And he uses the glass on the way. Thompson's got his second basket of the night. Well, that's how you draw it up right there. A screen to shed the defense. A quick move to the bucket. And you get the lay-in. Smart dishes to White. Moves back up. And he sinks the layup. And the Celtics lead by seven. And without looking at the scoreboard, you think... They were the team trail and trying to fight their way back. Curry kicks it to Looney on the wing. Thompson over White. The shot by Thompson, no good. This touch from mid range that's almost always good. That won't shake his confidence. Pass to Horford to the middle. Here's Smart. And that one goes long. Warriors trail by seven. To the inside. And stolen by Tatum. Outside, White. Back to Tatum. Over Wiggins. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Green finds Curry. There's Looney. Outside, Green. Thompson, and it's Thompson with the jam. Wow, what a setup there. Green plays with great speed and Green. plays with great pace. And that's a nice field play. And so White will bring it up for the Boston Celtics. It's a five-point game. And it's Looney with the rebound. Looney's got six rebounds in the game. Here's Curry with the three in the hoop for his fourth that field goal. Four for three. seven shooting and looking Four. for more. A really strong second quarter in terms of scoring the basketball. The Celtics have gone four of ten in the second quarter from the field. Tatum with it. Now Green defending. That's the smart. Inside. Here's White. The layup missed. He's not very hard to defend right now. This is when the defense might step back and let him try to find his range. And Thompson kicks to Curry. Here's Green. And a great assist by Curry. And that one goes in. It's a tie ball game. That's a tough one there from Draymond Green. As tough as they come. There's White. to Tatum. 
and that one's drained from the low block. Tatum's got six. That's the kind of passing you want there. Work the ball around, keep it moving, try to get an assist on every bucket. Thompson in the post. Light covering. Thompson misses. The Celtics are gone 5 and 12 from the field here in the second. Light the pass to Horford. Outside Tatum. Bangs home the trifecta. Ten points in the game so far. Sweet to be a difference maker in the game, and he's been a great option for them on these possessions. Curry against Smart. Thompson outside. The pass to Green. Just five on the clock. Let's it go from deep. Leaps for it, and it's out of bounds. The Celtics will take it the other way. So the Celtics call timeout. They're first. Boston, timeout. It's T-shirt time. All right. Look who's coming on out to the court. Come on and get loud. Here are the Celtics dancers. So Boston going with almost an entire new group. Daniel Tice is checked in for Robert Williams. Williams comes in for Al Horford. Brown is checked in for Derek White. And it's Pritchard in for Smart. And then for Golden State. Kamingas come in for Green. Porter comes in for Wiggins. And Poole subbed in for Thompson. Celtics leading by five. Outside Tatum. Over in the corner, Brown. Good, and it's Tatum picking up the assist. Brown's got 20. And that's one way to extend the lead. Continue to light it up from long range. They have all the confidence in the world right now from the three point line. That's, that's tough because that one's preventable. The defense has nothing to do at all with that turnover. Gary Payton has checked in for the Warriors. Celtics on offense. It's been eight unanswered points for him. Screen by Tice. Tatum against Porter. Tatum dishes to Brown. Pulls up on the elbow. Here's Tice. And Tice throws it down. That's what he gives you. A big time presence on the glass. And you know what, Greg? Once he gets his hands on it, he's not even thinking about kicking it out. Oh, his competitiveness right now is why the teammates love him. Daniel Tice. And a moment now to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for Boston. Guys, they are dialed in What's from up? beyond right now. They didn't waste any time getting into a groove in this game. I'm loving the ping pong action of the ball tonight. A decent number of assists so far. That's good from Tice. Warriors trail by 11. Now, Poole. Five points in the game. From past the arc, the shot is good. And so is his shooting tonight. Three for four. They're having more success from three-point range here in the second after a rough first quarter from deep. Austin's gone two or three when they've stepped beyond the arc in the second quarter. Richard passes the Brown. And they wasted no time getting those three points back. Brown's got 23 points. And I like the back and forth here, showing confidence from Rain. It seems like they're going to find out who can make the deepest threes. Right now, it's a shootout. There's Kaminga on target from 13 feet. Kaminga's got six points. Austin leading by nine. Here's Pritchard. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Passes it to Tatum. Williams sets a screen for Tatum. Outside Williams. Let's the three fly. Good. It's Tatum picking up the assist. Tatum's got three assists tonight. Oh, great ball movement there. Warriors trail by 12. Pass to Kaminga. 
Porter kicks to Kaminga. Kaminga sets a screen for Payton. Over Williams. No good from Payton. Boston's gotten out from three-point land in the second quarter, going four of five from downtown. Pritchard passes to Tatum. Shoots the three. And again, Boston with the triple. How about the last five made shots have all been threes. The defense is just giving up a ride. Golden State. Hey, fans. Who wants a free t-shirt? Make some noise. All right. Look who's coming out onto the court. Come on and get involved. Here are the Celtic Sensors. Trail by 15. Cool with it. He's got eight. He leads us at the screen. And again, no good by Golden State. The Celtics shooting with confidence 50% from the field so far. Pass to Pritchard. Launches a three. A new 14 for Boston. The Warriors have gone 8 of 16 from the field in the second quarter. A nice, efficient 50%. Kaminga, no good. On offense, here are the Celtics. They're on a 20 to 5 run here. Here's Williams, and Williams throws it down. Williams, hard finish there, guys. Yeah, and only one hand needed for that one. And so it's Golden State with it. Reeling by 17. Now, here's Poole. And the pass to Kaminga. Six to shoot. Porter kicks to Bialitsa. Good, and a nice assist from Porter. Bialitsa's got his first three points of the game. Bialitsa, when he gets those feet set, that shot looks so good. Celtics leading by 14. Passes it to Tatum. There's 138 left to play here in the second quarter. Golden State's gotten half their shots from three-point range to go down in the second quarter. Three of six from downtown. Kaminga with it. He's against Williams. Kaminga sets a screen for Porter. Now the dish to Kaminga. And a miss there on the triple. Boston shooting the ball beautifully in the second quarter. They're at 55% for the field. And here's Brown outside. Porter pulls it in. And so it's Porter bringing it up now for the Warriors. It's a 14-point game. Here's Peyton. Jalen Brown with the rebound. Brown's got rebound number five here tonight. To the inside. Tice. Rebound by Bialica. The Warriors shooting at 44%. Pretty reasonable. Peyton against Williams. Peyton can't get it to go. Seven second difference. Shot and game clock. Here's Pritchard. Guarded by Poole. Pritchard gets the bucket. Great job of screening. Where? Nice job of taking to the rim and get the finish. And here is Poole. Now Kaminga. Back to Poole. And the last shot of the buzzer doesn't go in for him. And so it's the Boston Celtics in command with a 16-point lead as the buzzer sounds. They have been sharp from beyond the arc, putting on a terrific three-point shooting display. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Thanks, guys. Here with Jason Tatum. You have been rolling early. How did you get in that rhythm? Uh, just staying aggressive. Uh, just continue to get in the gym and uh, 
see some go in. It, it was good to see them go in early. And it was good to have us have a good start. Uh, hopefully we keep it up. Yeah, it was flowing great in that first half, Jay. Thanks very much. Back to you guys. All right, thank you, David. And folks, don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. And we thank you for joining this postseason broadcast, and it's been an outstanding first half for the Boston Celtics. They played smart. They took their time and limited mistakes. When you value each possession, you eventually will get the shot you want. But when you lose the ball, you have no control over the destiny. Looking at the series breakdown for the Warriors. After losing home court advantage with a split in the first two games, how important is it for them to come away with a win in game three? It's huge. They don't want to go into game four with the must win situation. <laughs> hey, you okay, big fella? Hey, yeah. are you okay? Uh, yeah, right. yep. Game four, right? get them choked up, Ernie. It does. It does. But for sure. You know, you want to put that major pressure on them in game four. You got to throw everything at them, including the kitchen sink and the coughs. Let's get you out to the start of the second half. And we're back with you, all set to bring you more action from game three. It's been a clinic out there by Jalen Brown. With so much on the line tonight, you have to be impressed with the way he came out and set the tone with his aggression. Yeah, the rest of the team seemed to line right up behind him, matching that kind of intensity and looking for him to come through with some big plays. Outside, the wings are Brown and Tatum. Horford is out there with Williams, and it's smart in at the point guard position. Hux is in the game for the Celtics. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. They get Stephen Curry. I admire the energy that Brown plays was so great at getting to the line. On the night, he's gone two for two at the strike. Brown at the line for two. And he knocks down the first one. Good on both. Here's Curry. Nine points in the game so far. Outside, Green. And there's the feed to Wiseman. Kicks it out to Wiggins. Four on the shot clock. And the officials call a traveling violation. And to make that mistake at this time is tough to come back from. Well, not making things easier on themselves right now, that's for sure. Pass to Brown. Horford with the screen on Thompson. Brown with it, picked up by Thompson. And they double up Brown. That shot, no good. Warriors trail by 18. Green dishes to Curry. Pass to Wiggins. And here's Wiseman. Kicks to Curry. No oh, good with the triple. Tatum passes to Smart. The pass to Horford. Kept alive. Wiggins with some nice deep. And so Curry will bring it up for the Warriors. Here's Green. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. Assist and it's six two. points for Draymond Wayne Green. Thompson. Celtics leading by 16. Here's Smart. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. 
Williams has a screen for Tatum. It's stolen by Green. For the finish. And Green slams it in. Green. where Draymond Green just completely disrupts a possession. He reads the offense well and takes a good calculated risk. For Boston, they've gone 0-3 and are still looking for that first bucket here in the second half. Brown outside. And the three off target. You know what, though? Sometimes you can be too open. I think it may have surprised him, and that's why he missed. Wiggins has gotten just one of six shots to fall here. Thompson against Smart. Offered up top. Tatum wide open. He fires one. Drops in the tray. Tatum's got 15. Such a solid and unique big man in today's game. Horford's passing skills and ability to find the open teammate is very special. Stephen Curry's shot is good. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Brown feeling out a bit. And Curry, here we go. And Boston with the rebound. Brown's got six rebounds in the game. Tatum passes to Williams. Brown wide open. He fired. Good and Smart gets the assist. Smart's got three assists in the game. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the third quarter. Passes to Wiseman. Wiggins against Tatum. Thompson from long range. Rebound by Williams. Williams has got his fourth rebound in this one. Smart kicks to Horford. Pass to Brown. There's a screen by Williams. And the Celtics hit again from deep. And really, as the three-pointers keep dropping, you get the sense that the frustration is mounting for the defense. Curry against Smart. Thompson outside. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. Nine points in the game so far. Mono, e mono. This is where it can get a little personal. Yeah, again, you can't take this too far to make it too selfish, but that exchange, that's fun to watch. Now, here's Tatum. Nice ball movement by Boston. Shot clock at six. There's Brown with the three. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Thompson outside. Pass to Wiseman. He kicks to Green. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. That's on Jalen Brown. There's always uh, arguments about how Draymond Green thinks he should get more calls. And maybe he's right. But for a physical guy, he does not spend a lot of time at the free throw line. Shooting two. No good on the free throw. Whitey's checked in for Tatum. Looney's checked in for Golden State. He hits the second from the line. So it's Boston now. White with it. Brown outside. And they double up Brown. And there's the call on Clay Thompson. That's his first foul. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Now here's Smart. No points in the game yet for him. And slam dunk by Smart. And this is where Smart's at his best, being aggressive, going towards the rim. Warriors trail by 18. Curry looking around. He dishes it to Thompson. And again, it's the Warriors missing. Outside, Smart. Back. 
back to Brown. The Warriors pull it in. Green's got rebound number seven for him tonight. Down low, Looney, and he makes no mistake on the slam dunk. And Looney is so long, gets up there and he rushes it. And so Brown will bring it up for Boston. 16-point lead. Wiggins with the block. Smart against Curry. The pass to Looney. Back to Curry. Good work defensively by Smart. Celtics leading by 16. Brown outside. Going inside. In the corner. Horford with it. No good on the triple. Golden State's gone one of four and three point shots here in the third. It's Thompson off the drive. Williams with the block. A main staple in Williams' game. That sixth sense for when to rise up and deter those shots. Now here's Smart. Passes it to Brock. Horford with the screen on Wiggins. Six to shoot. Here's the three. Andrew Wiggins grabs the board. Well, if he's going to keep shooting, they've got to run some plays for him. Screens, pick and rolls, anything they can do to get him started. Boston's going to less than productive 2 of 6 from three-point land in the second half. Brown outside. Williams has a screen for Brown. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Green taking his time here to the middle and taken away by Brown. In the corner, Horford with it. But Trey, not going to go that time. The Warriors go the other way. And it's just one of those days, guys. He has just struggled to shoot the basketball. Well, the defender was all over Kevon Looney, and he got physical right back. That's a nice play. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for Boston. They keep piling up the assists, and they haven't pulled off at all. And it's a feel-good night from behind the three-point line, racking up a ton of threes. Shooting two. free throw no good if you have the good fortune of playing next to superstars in this league there are certain guys who thrive in that environment and Kevon Looney has been one of them looking at who's out there now for the Celtics Daniel Tice is checked in for Robert Williams Williams comes in for Al Horford and it's Pritchard in for smart and he sinks the second Celtics leading by 15 Time call here. The Celtics Boston. decide to talk it over. Someone is that craziest fans get a free t-shirt. Let me know who wants a t-shirt. All right. Look who's coming on up to the court. Come on and get loud. Here are the Celtics dancers. The Warriors making a switch here. Violates has checked in. Golden State down by 15. To stop the drought. And the ball goes out of bounds. Oh, wow. Last touch by Bielitsa. Oh. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. And that block was something. It's the playoffs. And every possession and defensive stop matters.
Brown against Porter. 13 feet away. And that one hits back iron. And he needs to find other ways to contribute besides shooting. Sometimes you, you have to learn how to play Whoa. well Ooh. when you're not playing well. And I'll bet his percentage is pretty high from that range. Austin leading by 13. Brown outside. White, wide open. He fights. Drains it from beyond the arc. White's got seven points in the game. What and the skills of Brown. Not just a super athlete, but a tremendous floor general as well. White against Peyton. Pocket six. Shoots off the step back. Misses off the left eye. These guys have had some good motion on offense. Nice assistant. And, and when everyone's involved offensively, it, it has a way of helping you on the defensive side as well. And the Celtics hit again from deep. Yeah, that's back to back three. The D just seems to be slacking off a little bit. Poole on the wing. Ten points for him. And it's blocked by Brown. White against Peyton. And White kicks to Brown. And it's Otto Porter Otto with the five. Porter. That's his that point. is his first foul of the game. And really, these are some of the toughest calls to an official has to make. Kevon Looney is checked in for by Looney. Here's Pritchard, guarded by Poole. A shot by Pritchard, no good. Warriors trail by 19. And here is Poole. Kicks it to Porter. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. Pass to Looney. They get in the corner. Five on the clock. Kaminga sets a screen for Peyton. Over Williams. And the shot is long. And when you can't get anything to fall, it definitely gets in your head. Especially if you're a player that doesn't get a lot of shot attempts. But otherwise, the mindset is, I just got to get the next one to go. And you don't want to put that much pressure on yourself. And it's the Warriors with the ball. Following the three-pointer by Boston. Porter finds Poole. Here's Looney. Golden State moving the ball around. They set the pick. And here's Poole for three. Hits it from three-point range. Poole's got 13 points. He's been terrific tonight, and with a little help from the other guys on the floor, they might be able to turn this game around. Here's Pritchard. It's rebounded by Kaminga. Warriors trail by 19. Pass to Poole. Dayton in the corner. Back to Poole. Misses in close. Boston shooting not looking uh, too good out there in the second half, right around 32%. And there's the pass to Brown. Picked by Williams. Brown with it. Kaminga picks him up. And it's Brown missing. Golden State's gone 2 of 5 with the three point shot since coming out of the break. White against Peyton. the drive and Peyton throws it down and that kind of defense ain't gonna get it done Gee, we don't see those kinds of dunks out of him all the time but we know he's got it in him. well any guy can throw it down against air defending him plenty of room so not so amazing what does amaze me though is that no one came over to contest the play and here at the end of the third quarter it's a double digit ball game Celtics out in front leading by 17 and we're coming right back after this break to get the fourth quarter underway. Fans, your Celtics dancers. Now let's listen in to head coach Steve Kerr. Got to get the first domino to fall, and then it's boom, boom, boom. The extra pass. We're not running plays to get a shot. We're running plays to get the domino to fall. So move the ball, drive and kick. We'll get great shots. All right. Well, he's preaching team chemistry right now, Greg. And he wants more ball movement because that makes everything simple. 
And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. Setting the floor for the Warriors. At the guard spots, it's Curry and Thompson. Higgins is out there with Curry, and it's Green in a tap. Tell you what, don't sleep on Tatum. He has some ups, and I love seeing him trying to electrify the crowd. On our at and 5G Slam Cam, you just saw an explosive highlight. Thompson, a screen arm smart. With the fadeaway. The shot by Thompson, no good. Not a whole lot going down for him at this point. He just can't buy a break. Smart against Kurt. To the paint. And Tice throws it down. And this is where Smart has really improved. The game's slowed down for him. He's playing under better control. Nice pass. Curry passes to Thompson. We're just over a minute into this final quarter of play. One made three form for the game. Does he focus closer in? Let's see. White dishes to Horford. Shoots over Kaminga. Draymond Green pulls it in. Green's got the glass covered here tonight. 11 boards for him. Thompson. And it's Thompson with the jam. Great signs as play goes vertical that time. Here's Smart. A little over a minute and a half of the fourth quarter gone. Outside Tatum. Passes it to Tice. Good, and it's Tatum picking up the assist. Tatum's got assist number five here tonight. Uh, assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball move. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Daniel Tice. That's his first foul. And the Celtics making a change here. Williams is checked in. Robert Williams. Kaminga sends a screen for Curl. He kicks to Kaminga. Smart against Curl. Lock at four over Horford. Curry shot is off. And here's Tatum. He'll bring it up for Boston. A great fourth quarter. Just giving up two points. Thompson against White to the middle. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Oh, he is a behemoth in the paint. Once Williams establishes himself, you almost have to foul. At the line for your Celtics. Robert Williams at the line for two shots. And he makes the first. And he can't hit the second. The Warriors have gone 1 of 4 since the end of the third quarter. Here's Wiggins, and Wiggins throws it down. And Wiggins showing a bit of strength, even with that frame of his, able to take the punishment and still get the score. Golden State. Andrew Wiggins. One shot. Mind the length. Mind the length. One shot. Throw good, Wiggins. Andrew Wiggins, one of those guys who just doesn't miss a lot of games and is always able to bounce back from any off night offensively. To the inside. Williams kicks to Horford. White against Thompson. Right side Tatum. A three. It's rebounded by Golden State. Not great numbers, but great effort in this one. Sounds funny, but I think he's been a positive for this. Really heads up there. A play where you locate the best open pass, and then you get it there for an easy bucket. Celtics leading by 18. 
Right the pass to Tatum. There's a screen by Williams. Thompson against White. Horford with the screen on Thompson. Six on the shot clock. Green with the block. And Green plays with tremendous edge on the defensive end of the floor. Here's Wiggins. And Boston with the rebound. Smart's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Tatum finds White. Back to Tatum. You can't get that one. And it's the Warriors taking it the other way. Wiggins surveying the floor over Tatum. And the rejection by Tatum. And how about the craftiness from Tatum? He plays smart, quick hands on defense, and able to block the shot. Mike goes in. Good D by Thompson. Warriors trail by 18. There's Kaminga. And Kaminga throws it down. Assisted. That's just a good look from Clay as his teammate was open. Celtics have gone three of eight here in the fourth quarter. Smart passes to Williams. Dishes it to White. Out to the right wing. Tatum against Wiggins. Williams has a screen for Tatum. Driving the lane. Oh, he jams it right over Tremont Green. Wow. And that's how you answer. I'd say he just won up to Pretty good one there. These two guys really, really like going at each other, don't they? Pass to Thompson on the arc. Rebound by Williams. Williams has got six rebounds now in the game. Pass to White. Outside, Horford. Outside, Tatum. And he drives in. And the dunk by Tatum. Diverse in terms of his offensive talents. Tatum is the type of player who you expect to score at least 20 every night. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Thompson. White with the defensive effort. Well, his poor shooting is a big reason that they're staring at this deficit right now. He needs to get on track if they're going to find a way to win. Curry against Smart. And White kicks to Tatum. And it's Jason Tatum with the foul. That'll be his second foul of the game. Yeah, just one turnover in the first half, but it's been a different story here in the second half. He is not doing a good job of keeping the ball in his mitts. Looney's checked in for Golden State. Curry against Smart. Here's Wiggins. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. That one on Horford. It's the aggressive part of Andrew Wiggins coming out of him, forcing the defender that time to get his hand in there. Andrew Wiggins. Shoot two. Throw good, Wiggins. And so he makes both from the line. And they came out of the locker room after halftime with a much more physical approach than what we saw in that first half. Here's White, and blocked the ball with his palm. What a defensive play. Inside, here's Looney. And Boston with the rebound. Smart's got his fifth rebound in this one. Horford with the screen on Kirk. White, good. Coaching staff would like some more shots from that range. And it's the Warriors with the ball. Curry passes to Looney. A 
on the wing, Wiggins. Here's the pass to Curry. A shot by Thompson, and no one's around. Play. Good, and it's Green picking up the assist. Play not forcing anything, just waiting for his time, and collecting points in the flow of the offense. Curry against Smart. Tatum on the wing. Shot clock at five. Free throw line, jump shot. No oh, good on the three. And so Green will bring it up for Golden State. Feeling by 17. Quick into the air. Andrew Wiggins up and throws it down. Now White. Williams has a screen for White. Takes it inside. And he makes good on the way. And the Celtics lead by 17. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Golden State's gone one of three from outside the arc since we've reached the fourth quarter. Curry passes to Thompson. And another three for Golden State. And Clay Thompson, one of those guys where you hit the switch as a lights out shooter. Pass to Tatum. Wiggins with the block. Thompson looking for an opening. Jacks up a three. Another three for Golden State. Sometimes you don't get this kind of aggressive Clay Thompson on the offensive end, but the teammates love to see it. Outside Tatum. Williams a screen on Wiggins. Tatum kicks to Williams. And there's the call on Curry. That's foul number two for him. Brown, he's checked in for Boston. The Warriors also with a sub. Porter's checked in. Substitution for the Warriors. Smart against Kurt. Now here's Smart. D right on him. Here's Williams. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. That's his second personal foul. Third team foul. At the line, Robert Williams. At the line for two shots. free throw no good and missing opportunities here to extend that lead at the free throw line this half and he's good on the second Warriors trail by 12. Outside Curry. Another three for Golden State. You know, sometimes basketball is not all that complicated. Just let Stephen Curry shoot threes and get out of the way. Smart passes to Tatum. Brown outside. Tries again. And Williams with the nice bucket inside. Williams has got four this quarter. And Matador defense, that's one of the easiest shots he is ever going to see. Yeah, it feels like Christmas right now, just gift wrapping points. They kick it out to Green. Fires the three. Horford with the rebound. Austin leading by 11. Smart finds Brown. Now here's Smart. Curry was a nice D. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. Brown against Porter. Here's Curry. Rebounded by Smart. Smart's got his second rebound here tonight. 
Down against Thompson. Outside, Horford. Celtics passing it around. Shot clock at six. From downtown. And the ball out of play. The Warriors won. And the Warriors making a change here. Ice rings checked in. James Wiseman. There's 126 left in the fourth. Curry against Smart. It's Curry with the drive. That one goes in. That's a clever attack from Curry. Just finding an angle. And he gets around the defender towards the back. If they want to, they can milk the clock just a little bit here. Yeah, that's the best option. Brown outside. Over Thompson. Busted. No good that time either. Just not sure if he ran out of energy at halftime or what, but uh, so far just not himself in the second half. And it's smart with the ball for Boston. Earlier they held a 23-point lead. Outside Tatum from outside the arc. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. On its way from Curry for two. Gets down the step Curry. back, Jay. Good shot selection there from Steph, feeling the rhythm and then easily connecting on the pull-up. Now here's Williams. He's covered by Wiseman. Pass to Tatum. Brown with a screen on Wiggins. The kick out to Brown. Five to shoot. Curry with the steal. Thompson from long range nails the triple. And boy, he's really in a groove. Dominant performance in the last game. Same thing this time out. Seems to be nobody standing in his way. No roadblocks for him to get to his spot, capitalize, and continue to be aggressive. Boston, climb up. It's T-shirt Bonanza. Make some noise. And the Warriors making a change here. Warriors substitution. And he commits the intentional foul. That's right. No other option but to foul and hope for some misses. That's his third personal foul. Fifth team foul. At the line for your Celtics, Marcus Smart. At the line for two. Good on the first, and that puts them up by far. And some of what Smart gives this team doesn't always show up in the stat sheet, but, but he makes plays that help you win. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a six-point ball game. Well, that'll ice it right there. Not everybody can keep their composure at the line in such a big situation. Ooh, what a teacher. Make some noise. Seven seconds left in the fourth quarter. 
And that will be Golden State as it goes out of bounds. Warriors retain possession. It's stolen by Tice. And so it's the Boston Celtics with the W. And they've edged in front in the series after an outstanding performance here in Game 3. Kevin, it sure was. When teams split the first two games of the series, Game 3 needs everything. They're going into Game 4 now, right at high after this move. And now, let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline for our player of the game. David, take it away. 